Hello guys, today I'm here on show Weencraft and on here I am going to play Slime Fun. Um, yeah, as you can see I've got like, there's things here that in the first place this looks like a skull on a plant and yeah, it, it looks it looks very vanilla, though it's not, like you can go play it with the vanilla client, that's why it looks like that, but it's um, it's like modded without the need of mods. It's um, the, the server has installed slime fun. That's what it's called, and it's amazing. So let me get into my inventory and put on my armor because I've got plenty of things. Let me store this away. I've played this a w little bit. Um, ooh, my sounds are very loud. Music and sounds. Let's go that to five percent. There we go. Let's put that in here. All right, I've got a full chest. I probably should make like a BSU. And you don't know what a BSU is. So, Slime Fun cons consists mainly of two mods Slime Fun and uh, Sensible Toolbox. Those are two different mods that don't communicate with each other, yet they are work very well next to each other. Uh, like these are Sensible Toolbox and these are BSUs, which allow you to stare at tons of tons of stuff in one barrel. It's uh, really useful. Um, let's see if I got some redstone. Just click on it and I've got redstone place it back in um, to get started always when you start on the server you should get a slime fun guide so if we open this and I've got some things unlocked let me go back you see this and you got a ton of stuff and everything is locked at start you gotta unlock things like um, weapons items basic machines tools and um, and the way you unlock this is with XP so that's how you go about doing th things. However, I'm not here to unlock things with, with XP. I still need to do some enchantments because I've got two silk touch pickaxes, but I still need like a good um, diamond fortune pickaxe. And I still don't have it. So I'm just going to start here live on camera. I'm going to make two of those pickaxes and we'll see what's up with that. So I need lapis. Again, I also have a, an awful bug. So two pickaxes. Let's see. Um, there's a, there's like the players on here are pretty pretty nice. Um, if you want to play, I'll leave the description down below. Um, I'll just say it. Uh, it's um, uh, Shawincraft.net. If I'm not mistaken, if I am mistaken, the correct IP is in the description below. So you have that. Let's go for it. I'm breaking three. There we go. I'm breaking three. Really? Wow. 30 levels. I'm breaking three. Fortune two. Do I want that? Oh, that's... That's... I mean, I could do like a simple bow. I mean, I need a bow. Fortune two, though. I want a fortune three. I mean, fortune two. You know what? I'm just going to go for it. Fortune two. Fortune two. Efficiency four. And I'm breaking three. Come on. You can do it. Fortune two, For fortune two, just fortune two. This is this is not going well. Hmm. Well, at least I can change my diamonds in a little bit more. It's not fortune three yet, but you know, I'm not. Complaining. It's just awful enchantments. I didn't know they were that awful. Uh, I should make a B issue for you. Do I have an empty B issue somewhere laying around? Um. Let us see. A B S U empty. Empty. There we go. B S U empty. Blaze rods. Place them in. As you can see if I open them, you can get things. It's private. It's locked now. Alright. So that's good. I could make another pickaxe and see if that gets better. You know what? I'm just gonna do that. Um I've got these two. Let me throw them here. As you can see I've got Efficiency 3 and breaking 3, so I could combine these to make like a good one. Uh, I've got a really good silk pick touch pickaxe, and this is breaking 3. Mm. And this is another silk touch, that is pretty good. Um, you know what? I'm just gonna make another one and see if it's good. If it's if it says silk touch, I'm not gonna take it, obviously, because I'm get some lapis 
This is basic standard survival, I know, but... Oh, there was some lag. It's not it's not a common thing, though. Oh, one, two, three. Okay. Right. It's not a common thing to have lag on here, so... Just this. And I forgot to make something. A uh, crafting table. Like this. And this. Alright. Get that going. I'm breaking three. I uh, just... What's with the awful enchantments? I'm. Mean, this is not fun. I should have not done that. Well, that's levels wasted. All right. Well, we still got some XP left, so we're gonna unlock stuff. Um. I can do that. Now, before I start unlocking things that I want to do, let me first get into this. Uh, uh, get tell you the premise of this entire series I want to get to a level where I can basically automate about anything and I want to get like a nuclear setup a nuclear setup meaning I can make nuclear stuff and I can produce energy on a nuclear level now that's all in this part energy and electricity and that's like a really far away part and that's gonna take ages to get there but before, uh, because I need to lock all basic machines to get all this. All right, and the basic machines are, let me see, basic machines are right over here. And I need to unlock the pressure chamber, the juicer, the crucible, and all these furnaces and the block blazer. So I've got plenty and plenty to unlock. Um, let me get you out of the way. So that's done. I don't need a bow. Let's place the bones back. Um, that's like a lot to unlock and I'm not gonna do all that on camera because unlocking is basically gathering XP and unlocking things however it would be cool if I can get 29 this episode so I can unlock the juicer I believe and juicer is also good for food so yeah but if you start off my, my, my tips are that you get like some of the basic uh, things set up so basic machines Enhanced crafting table, basically the most important thing you get. Enhanced crafting table and then get yourself uh, an ore crusher to get crusher's ores to double them. And then get a smeltery so you can make metals. Then mine a lot of coal, a lot of uh, iron. That's those things you need. And as soon as you get uh, these, go and unlock in the weapons tier look unlock the cobalt sword now the cobalt sword is very cheap because you can as you can see it's a very good weapon it's i I've, this is my first one i still haven't overused it it's a breaking seven sharpness seven two hit kill everything and yeah it's really good and cobalt ingots are pretty cheap it's copper dust iron dust and nickel ingots and a nickel ingot nickel ingot is iron dust iron ingot and copper dust and copper dust is really really common it's like mine coal and you get tons of it as you can see i've got here 108 copper dust so this these are very very cheap and same for the pickaxe the cold pickaxe i don't have one right now but it insta mines the um the the area here so let me see the copper pickaxe is like if you go to tools and go to cobalt pickaxe this one i unlocked it's cobalt ingots and nickel ingots, so very cheap, and it's efficiency 6, and unbreaking 3, and it's, I mean, it's not incredibly good as in how long it works, I mean, it's just an iron pick with unbreaking 3, and you know how long those last, but it's incredibly fast, so yeah, it's definitely worth making. So once you got those two, that you're you're basically set to get started with things. Uh, Creeper, can you not? Even though mob grieving is off. Yeah. All right. Um. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. What was I thinking? What was I thinking? All right. I was going for the. All right. Oh yeah. My elytra. Um. If you really get advanced, like magic is one of the coolest things I think, but they they are pretty like it's pretty expensive to to do magic. Like those are pretty expensive recipes. If you if, let me look into uh, into what I made, 
Um, it's a magical gadget. Hello, zombie. Oops. Should have created them. Alright. So. Magical gadgets. Here. There's the Elytra. And the Elytra is... You got the Elytra scale. And you got the Ancient Rune Air and Leather Tunic. Leather Tunic is the easiest part. Like, Ancient Rune Air. It's pretty doable. Like, only the gas tears, But you can buy them in the shop here. Thankfully. I uh, wasn't in the first place asked for that. It's better to buy them in the shop. Because gas tears are impossible to get. Especially on here. Um, nearly 200 each. So, it's not too bad. Um, this is the Ultra skill. I think that's a misspell. But... Let's see. I got air and ender, and the enders, like the ender lumps, this equals to eight eyes of ender. One of these. Eight eyes of, eyes of ender, and you need four of these. So four times eight equals 32. 32 times four equals 128. You need 128 of these of these ender lump three, and then you think you're done. No, because these take them as well so you need you need like so many so many you need um, but the good thing is you only get, you get like six for them so that's better um, that's magic and it's you make them by an altar you like you place the ingredients on the thing then you click with the middle thing on the middle and that works but we're not doing magic today we're not doing magic today um, yet it is highly uh so it's 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 really i can recommend you start doing that because i've got the elytra i've got the elemental star elemental star of wind and when i do this it's just i can fly i can fly infinitely as you can see all right let me land in the water here all right so I gotten back from some cow killing and breeding and I got a ton of leather. That's what I got. And I also got um got twenty nine levels. So what I'm gonna do is you know, I was still thinking of unlocking the juicer. Though one of the main uh things I wanna have is this backpack. I wanna have a of a backpack. So what I'm gonna do is gonna go to uh tools and then there are no nope, tools items and then there is a small backpack which costs 15 levels so if i unlock you start wondering about backpacks see i'm wondering about backpacks and then unlock the backpack until the large backpack i want to get that large backpack i don't want to get like medium backpacks oh uh items so let's get how do you make a large backpack you need gold ingots and leather and for small backpack is gold ingots 10 carat and leather and the small backpack is called in its six carat and leather all right that's pretty doable and it needs an enhanced crafting table so let's 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 make that let's make that right so that was five leather each so i need 15 leather i've got that i've got plenty of that so one two three one two three there we go 15 leather now i need a lot and lots of gold um i don't think i i couldn't mine for it though it's not like I want uh, gold. I hope this will be enough. Let me just uh, change that into. All right, I've got 21, 29 gold dust. So first, I need the six. So that's. Oh, I need to light that again. I need to make that automatic as, as well. So many things to do in this. So many things to do. So many things. Um. Let me see. Where is you? Where is you? Where is you? Where is you? What was I looking for? I am looking for this. Flint and steel. I'm not sure if this flint and steel will last for this smelting session. Probably should make another one at some point. But, alright. So let me show you. Um, this is now a 4 carat. So if I apply one more gold dust, like this, it becomes a 6 uh, carat. And I, we need two of that so let's slide that all right now we've got two six carat gold ingots we need it now now we need two ten and two sixteen so one so a ten is eight all right 
and that's 10. All right, now make that six, eight, and 10. All right, now we need the 16, and I think that's seven times, if I'm correct. 10, 12, and it's 116. I need another one of 16. It's gonna be like, I don't have any gold left when this is done. I nearly need to get gold mining. It's strange though, normally I get plenty of gold. Um, where should I get my gold at? Um, right, I've got flints, should be in here. All right, flint. Maybe I still have some iron left in this. Yeah, I've got some iron left. There we go. And that's another flint and steel. You know how to make them. Whoop, someone gave me the room. My bad. Um, yeah. Let's get the... What was I doing? What was I doing? What was I doing? All right. Let's do this. And... All right, that's six. That's ten. That's twelve. 14, 16. Right, we've got enough to make that, but we are out of gold entirely. That's just gonna be a problem. Right, let me just unlock this and then place this in. There we go, and then lock it again. So I can basically use that as gold dust. If I ever need gold ingots, I can just use the smelter over there. Um, Let me see. Gold, there we go. So the gold pack pack it basically wait it needed something a chest all right i've got plenty of wood should have um there we go one two three four five six seven eight so what i do is i place the wood like this and then it's these nope i need to do this in the enhanced crafting table by the way, the Ion's crafting table, the, uh, they are all multi-block, so basically the way you make it is you place a dispenser facing up, and then this is the dispenser, and then it's your crafting table on the top, and as you click it, it makes it. So I'm just going to make this, this is going to be like this, and then like this, and that should make a small backpack. Um, thing is, with backpacks, once you use them, you can't use them for crafting. So. It's a safety thing, so your items don't get lost, but you gotta take that into mind. So if I want to make another one, I can't use this backpack to get a higher tier. But I don't need that higher tier at the moment, so... Wait, that's not it. 16, 16, backpack, 18. Why isn't that it? Why isn't that it? Alright, so let me go back. That's a small... Really? 14? Oh no. Oh wow. Alright, that's not so smart. I guess, I guess, um, how am I gonna do this? Well, this is not useful. I've got two gold ingots with... Let me place those in there. I don't have any gold in here, do I? This is uh, bad. Oops. Well, I'm gonna try to fix this and now back. That'll be back. Alright, I got back and I've got very good news. No Hex, just Bounty, um, gave me 43 gold dust. And that, that helped me a lot. And this, this community is amazing, so if you, if you decide to play here, it's definitely worth it. Um, now let's not make that same mistake again. Uh, 8, 14 it was. 12, 14. There we go, we needed to make that. 10, oh. 12, 14. There we go, we've got the 14, and now we've got the plan D. This is so good. But uh, really, thank you to No Hex, No Bounty, because oh, No Hex, just Bounty. Um, oh, hey, I'm getting this. Can you? All right, I'm getting out of here. All right, you're not getting me. 
Right, let me see. Get in the door, get in the door. Nope, that was a total fail. Um, got the ingots. Now let's see if we can make this happen. Right, this, this, and then the 14 carroting. It's not the 16 and place this. And we've got a backpack. We've got a backpack. So if we open this, we've got a backpack with 16 slots. That is very, very useful. At least I can do, I can put a lot in there. Actually, uh, place this in here. Place the diamonds. I'm going to place them in here. Um, flint. flint. Flint goes in there. So many stuff I have. Yeah, I have not all the things I need. Um, I need to get my fortune too. Let me just get my fortune too. Should I combine that? Should I combine that with this one? Right, can I combine that? So if I do this, that's nine. If I do this, that's eight. Always better to use eight. Should I name it? No, I'm just gonna do this. And I am gonna mine these diamond ores and see what they give me. Place them up. I haven't gotten that many diamond ores. I think. Right. Hey zombie, do I have a bow? I do have a bow. Can you die please? This is not a strong bow, but should do. Alright. That's uh, all right. Tell me, tell me how ma many things, how many uh, diamonds you think I'm gonna get in the comments because I don't know. Fortune two. So with a bit of luck, I can double it. So that's my guess is fifty. That's beforehand. You're gonna just say over or under. Hey, can you? Hmm. Right. Where are you? Where's the zombie at? There you are. Alright. Is there no... Oh, ground diamonds will be removed in 60 seconds. I'm not going to mine diamonds whilst the ground diamonds gonna, are going to be removed. Not going to do that again. I did that before. Mine diamonds. Oops. All the ground items removed. Well. But I'm going to mine these diamonds. In a bit. Um, after that. Oh, only 20 seconds. I am gonna do show you how this magic system works and I'm gonna call it a day because I think this episode is getting long enough with all these new impressions and stuff. I'm all over the place, I know that. But that doesn't but don't worry. We'll get into the big stuff again. This is purely an introduction to what it is. I'll have some better goals set at that time. I do want to get into nuclear, that's that's my entire end game. Um as you can see by the title. But I want, that. yeah. This is this is what I want. I, I I enjoy this game so much. It's it's like I don't know. It it completely changes Minecraft to the extent. Did, did all the game? Oh yeah, removed items. We can start mining. All right. You said uh, tell me how much you said in the comments. And don't say like I know I can like it's exactly either you got extremely lucky. Then again, you do it for yourself. I'm not gonna give. Let someone win. Alright. Let me see. Alright, I sat 50. I've got... I've got the zinc and tin dust from that. Hmm. 45. Okay, that's not... That's less than I expected. But it's still good. It's still good. I, I can live with that. I can live... Definitely with that. This is all magical lumps. Alright, I, I I promised you some magic now. Um magic is very cool. Magic is very, very cool. Um I am going to get me some resources and then I'll be at the altar and I'll show you how to do magic. So welcome back to my amazing and great looking altar. Um this is not like I'm this is all temporary stuff. I'm just need to make things look better creepers all over the place um, to make this blank rune so I'm gonna get a look at things so a blank rune it should be under magical items and then there's a rune and I want to have a blank rune because that's what you need to make the other runes so a blank rune as you can see is corners are with stone magical on one 
in on the sides and then obsidian in the middle and it says ancient altar this is an ancient altar right to say is so on the sides is always on this uh, direction doesn't matter actually you can make it any direction now this is a symmetrical one so you make place the items on each of the pedestals and then you click it with the central um, block in the middle and then you watch as things happen magic happens all right i'll click it and as you can see particles happen and it basically takes out all the things and uh, i think i think it's one of the best things about this like this is there is no i don't have any mods oh there's a diamond i forgot so 46 if you set 45 if you set 45 shame on you you, you, you missed that diamond oh well but um with that with me getting a blank rune i think i'm going to end this episode right here right like this um so yeah thank you for watching and i hope you enjoyed make sure to leave a like if you enjoyed make sure to subscribe if you want to see more of this and i will see you in a later episode all right Bye.